Hello and welcome to another Demon 212 VC review. Today I'm going to take a look at Poyo Poyo 2 on the Sega Mega Drive slash Genesis depending on where you live. If you don't know, Poyo Poyo 2 is a puzzle game, it's one of the Hanabi games, so it's got a lot of Japanese and it costs a little bit more. The operations guide does help you with the menus here, it does actually translate the menus for you, so it kind of makes you wonder why I didn't just translate the game like they did with Sin and Punishment. But basically the one on the left is single player game, middle is the multiplayer and the one on the right is the options where you can choose like your timer and basically difficulty and stuff like that. In the top left there, you've had, you may notice that you've got an AXP thing and basically the whole point is you've got to defeat all the characters on the row and the likes and get enough AXP. If you don't defeat, uh, well if you don't get enough AXP after defeating everyone, then you have to face a boss and if you still don't, then basically you lose. So you always have to get as much AXP as you can and you can track your AXP by looking in the middle bottom of the screen there, which is basically that little pink number that keeps going up, that's how much AXP you've currently got and you can get like loads by just holding down and the likes to speed the um, the blobs up or you can get them by causing combos and stuff. Whole point of the gameplay is it's similar to Tetris I suppose you basically have to match four blobs or more uh, obviously Tetris was a full line but on this you have to match four blobs or more and you can have them in any form you can have them like in this here like an L form there or a Z form or stuff like that and after you delete them if you manage to cause a combo like what I've just done there if you notice on the right screen there, then there's going to be a load of what are called garbage blobs coming down. Garbage blobs, they're basically clear ones, they're harder to get rid of because you have to actually, they have to be touching blobs that you're about to delete. So that's pretty much the whole game for the most part. Um, at the very top middle of the screen there you can tell what blobs you're about to get, so you can help plan combos and stuff to obviously help defeat your opponents, and you lose by, well when the blobs hit the top of the screen you lose. I'm going to shut up now for a few seconds or just a little listen to the music and the voices because frankly I think they're pretty damn good. So there we go then, that was a bit of the music, and this here is the versus menu screen, where once again the operations guide is going to be your friend. There's loads of different modes of gameplay though, there's like elimination modes and score modes and stuff, and basically it's the same game though, the whole point is you have to, well, delete blobs to kill your opponent off. Uh, probably should have mentioned this earlier, but if uh, you might have already noticed that this is basically Mean Bean and Ghost Squad. Well, Mean Bean is actually the first Poyo game and Ghost Squad is kind of like a clone. So if you're wondering which one to get, this one does cost 100 points more, but personally I think it's a better game. It's got like it's got better graphics, better sound and all that, and just a lot more modes. There's a lot more multiplayer modes than that. The only thing it doesn't have is Main Bean has an endless mode where you don't have to play an opponent, you can just play and play and play. So if you really like those type of modes, then you're going to have to go for Main Bean. But otherwise, this is just a, a better game overall. It's a lot more balanced and more well-rounded and just a lot more fun personally. So there we go then. That's been the review. I hope you found it helpful. I don't score the games because that's based purely on opinion, so instead I'll leave you to make your own mind up. So thanks for watching and if you've got any questions about the game that I didn't answer in the vid or that hasn't been answered in the comments then feel free to ask and I'll help if I can. Also if you did find it helpful don't forget to check out my channel because there's plenty more like this up there and don't forget to subscribe because there'll be plenty more to come as well. So until next time, this has been Demon212, signing off.